wonderful, heartwarming memory of Marilyn Monroe, the one and only time I ever met her. I was a young actor in New York, just beginning. It was the summer of 1959. Then one night, word came backstage that Marilyn Monroe was in the audience. After the show, all the actors were getting out of their makeup and changing. I was just an extra, and I was in a tent with the other extra men in the back of the theater. When we heard this voice, familiar voice, Marilyn Monroe, from outside the tent, ask if she could come in. She was gorgeous, of course, and exuded sex also. Blonde, alabaster skin, almost no makeup, maybe a little eye makeup. She wore a white dress, low cut, and very tight fitting, no jewelry. Uh, white shoes, and she was carrying a white raincoat. And the image was just all white and pure and gorgeous and sincere and humble. And your heart went out to her. You just wanted to embrace her. She seemed like a little lost girl. We walked to the parking lot and there was a little hill you had to climb in order to get to the parking lot. And there we saw Marilyn Monroe at the top of the hill, uh, waiting all alone. I turned around for her last look, and that was my last image of her, standing there on the hill, all in white, waiting.